Hey everybody, it's Ross and I'm a chef. No, I'm not a chef. I'm just a cook. I like to cook. I play one on TV though. Chef? No, I'm just joking. I, I love to cook and I love to eat healthy the best I can. So people call me up all the time. They see my Facebook page, Cooking with Ross. So they go to my YouTube channel and see all my soup recipes, all my salmon, all the stuff I like to eat. And they call me up sometime and I, I do food coaching too kind of off the radar, so if you need some help with where to start with your family, I usually clean out your closet, your pantry, uh, go to the grocery store with you, show you which aisles to avoid, and then show you how to cook one pot wonders in your kitchen because families are busy. So if you need some help with that, let me know. But I wanna share, you, uh, share with you a story. I'm beat, B-E-E-T. Now I'm not tired, but I'm, B -E I'm beat. Funny pun on a story. I want to show you something, what I've discovered. On, on TV, you see the powdered beet stuff. Put it in water and you drink it. I'm trying to drink less coffee. I only drink like two cups. I don't drink a lot of coffee. I used to drink it all day long, back in the day. And uh, that was when I, 20 some odd years ago, I smoked cigarettes all day and drank coffee all day. Can you imagine that? No, those were that day, now it's the day of today. So, what I wanted to show you, give you some hints that I've discovered. Superfoods are good. Black beans, beets, fruits, vegetables. Uh, beets are one of the superfoods. This is a great product. Now, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you a trick. This is a superfood. Believe it or not, it has nothing in it that's bad. Now you got to watch packaged foods, read the labels. Why would you want to read a label that f with food you're putting in your body? No, not doing that. I'm not counting calories and I'm not ordering cardboard prepared meals that I put in the microwave. That's nasty. That has so much preservatives in that because they have to preserve the food, deliver it to your door and then you heat it up. Don't do that. That's a waste of money, waste of time, waste of nutrition. Eat like Adam and Eve the best way you can. Always be pointed toward the garden, as I always say. Uh, this is no GMO, kosher, gluten-free, no preservative, grown in the USA. This is, this is a great product right here. Cooked beets. Beets are hard to cook from scratch. I like beets, but you gotta peel them, clean them, wash them. These are already cooked. So all you gotta do is rinse them off and cut them into chunks, put them in your salad, whatever, they're delicious. But look what it's got in it. No saturated fats, no polyunsaturated fats, no trans fats, no saturated, I mean, there's no fat in it. Look at this, no cholesterol, if you're looking out for cholesterol. By the way, if you're taking cholesterol meds from your doctor and you're eating cholesterol, that doesn't make sense, does it? It's got a little bit of sodium, not much, 85 milligrams, uh, and that's minimal. But always read the labels if you're having salt issues or just no salt, then you don't want to eat packaged food, but this is very little salt. A fiber, it's good fiber. Uh, sugars, like six grams, nothing. It's just it's sugar beets. Uh, no uh, sugar alcohol, vitamin D, calcium, iron, potassium. Potassium is 340 milligrams. Phosphorus, 26 milligrams, and magnesium, 21. And it says ingredients. Beets. <laughs> this is a great product. Get it. You get it at Kroger. They have some good health food uh, items and, and, and aisles, unlike they used to. This is a great product. Get it. Now, I like this is superfood. Another superfood is apple cider vinegar. Always have a big jar of this. This is, this is what you should have in your house all the time. I make my olive oil and, and vinegar at dressing with some lemon juice, pour it over my green salad. Don't, don't buy a bottle of vinaigrette or any kind of bottle of dressing. Make your own. I can make ranch dressing out of yogurt and, and this and vegan eggs. I can make my own ranch. So keep this. This is a superfood. Apple cider vinegar should be in your diet all the time. Superfood, superfood. Okay, so I'm trying to drink less coffee and I want some energy. So, you know, the caffeine buzz goes down and you're probably drinking coffee too much, like me. My doctor said, my chiropractor said this, if you drink two cups of coffee, to each cup of coffee takes eight ounces of hydration out of your body. One cup, eight ounces. So that means you have to drink 16 water, uh, ounces of water to catch up if you drink two cups of coffee. I'm trying to drink more water. 
uh, and it'd be more hydrated, not less. So that's something to keep in mind. So these two are superfoods. I like both of them. They're both excellent for you. So guess what I did? I took my Pampered Chef bottle. Don't you love that Pampered Chef? It screws and it's got a little uh, disc in it. So it presses down whatever you have in your bottle and you screw it. It's got a little hook on it for you know always keeping it. This is a great product. If you want some Pamper Chef products, my friend carries them. This is something that you should have. You can put blueberries in there, strawberries. I put strawberries and blueberries. I put my unsweetened vanilla almond drink in it. I don't drink milk, but that almond drink with fruit is delicious. And you squash it down and you have that all day. Now, I pour that into the beets. You got that program. Now, it's a little tangy. But watch this. Mm. Yeah, it's a kick, all right. That will uh, put some oil in your engine, you know what I mean? Uh, naturally. So try it. I mean, it's, it's nothing, this is perfect food. This is, this is super food. And so it will give you the energy you need without the crash. You can do it after lunch, like at three o'clock when you go, you know, after lunch. This will also, if you drink this in the morning, will curve your appetite so you won't eat like a huge lunch. You know, go out and eat a big old plate or whatever. And then come back to work going like at, you know, two or three o'clock, you're going, uh, uh, This will help you curb your appetite, but give you all the nutrients you need. So. I'm beat, I'm Ross, but I'm beat, but I'm doing the right thing. Try that. Try that as a combo. You'll like it. Your family will like it. Oh, a little secret. I do put a little agave, a squirt of an agave or honey in there just to, just to take out the tang of the apple cider vinegar. It's, it's a shot, all right. And you go, whoop, just like I said. What? Mm. Uh, well, so you, you want to take out that you can dilute it with water too. You know, a splash of water, so you can mix water with your apple cider vinegar. But make sure your water is zero zero zero. Bottled water has total dissolved solvents in there. My tap water is sixty five. If you put a meter in it, I go through my zero water container and it goes zero zero zero. So make sure you test your water. You don't have to ever buy water because look at my fa Facebook page on my YouTube. It's zero water container. I haven't bought water in two years because I get it out of the tap, but it filters through the charcoal filter. So hope this helps you. Superfood. Ross is beat. I'm out of here. I've got my buzz on. I got my buzz on. Try this combo and let me know how you like it. Go to my YouTube pages, YouTube, Ross Antonakis. I've got thousands of videos on food, fun, faith, family, and friends. And also go to my Cooking with Ross Facebook page and let me know how you like what I'm doing. And hopefully it helps you and encourage you to eat better. Always remember, do what you can, where you can, when you can, the best you can, but do something. And your body will like you for it and God will love you for it as well. Until next time, look me up, call me, give me a ring, give me a shout, give me an email, whatever is good for you. Talk to you soon. Take care and God bless.